As Parliament prepares for its summer recess, critics note that the Trudeau government has only gotten a couple of dozen bills through Parliament since it came to power, far less than Stephen Harper's majority government had reached by this time in its mandate. So what gives? Are the Liberals bereft of new ideas? Well, no, but the government is in a bit of a lull, that's for sure. The simple truth is that Finance Minister Bill Marneau delivered on most of the Trudeau government's priorities in his first budget, way back in 2016. Tax cuts for the middle class, improved childcare and infrastructure, lots and lots of infrastructure, which could improve everything from public transit to the digital highway. But these projects take time. It's also true that the Liberals have failed to deliver on some big commitments. Where is the transformation in relations with Indigenous Canadians that Mr. Trudeau had promised? Whatever became of electoral reform? And where is that restored home mail delivery we were promised? Bogged down, cancelled, or just lost in the shuffle? For Andrew Scheer, the twinkle-eyed new Conservative leader, the Liberals' real failure has been to contain the deficit. Mr. Scheer's best asset is a cutting wit that has left Mr. Trudeau frowning at times. It's going to be fun to watch these two. There are still big things to come, including a major announcement on culture policy and the legalization of marijuana. The NDP will finally choose a new leader, so we'll be paying more attention to them. But everything may take a backseat to NAFTA, as the Trudeau government seeks to protect continental free trade from the cantankerous President Trump. So enjoy your summer, everyone. We'll have plenty to talk about come fall. <laughs>